Hello everyone, right, welcome to part 152 of my uh, Digimon walkthrough. Right, so this part, I need to train, rains a lot. I'll do one day of training, then I'll probably do all the rest online, so I'll tell you what stats you need. So, rains apparently need 600. So we've got a bit of a, we've got a, bit of a mountain to climb here. Weight, I think, needs to be 30. I don't know what my weight is, I'll have a look in a minute. Weight's bang on, so that's I'm not too bothered about that. And speed, I think, needs to be 400. So I'm nearly there for speed. So I've done three lessons, and then if I do another, like, I should get uh, my brains up to 300 by the end of the day, anyway. Then I'll have to train and train and train. Yeah, you need. Good brains, you need 600 on brains apparently. 400 on speed. Offense and defense don't matter. I mean, you need, uh, you need 100 on discipline. 500 on brains though might be enough, because I think as long as you get discipline, then probably the stats won't matter. As long as you've probably got speed, I think the other stats probably won't matter. That's the way it's normally gone. I think if we get about 550 on brains, I'll probably still get him. As long as I get the weight and everything else, I think I'll be fine. Just don't do any care mistakes and I'll be fine. So no care mistakes, no battles. If you battle, you've automatically lost. So no care mistakes, no battles. 100% happiness, 100% discipline. Um, 600 brains. 400 speed. It says you need HP and MP, but I don't think you do. I think if you get all the other stuff, I think the stats don't matter. That much. I think if you have no fights and no discipline, you get a bonus point, so it overrides the HP and MP. So I think if you get the happiness discipline and no battles and the perfect weight, that's four. Brains is five and then speed is six. You only need probably six out of eight. You only need six, I think, criteria. So I don't think you need HP and MP to be honest. So you need 4,000, but I don't think you will. You might do, but I don't think I will. I can't see it, to be honest. So, we'll have a look in a bit. See what happens. Right. So for now, I'll feed him that. When his discipline's uh, 100%, I'll give him a few super carrots, get his weight down a bit. Because uh, at the moment he's on 300 brains. But I don't think he'll like super carrots, so... Uh, yeah, don't think that's going to go very well, to be honest. I'll probably get him to about weight 40 then, when he's about weight 40, I'll feed him to a few super carrots. Yeah, always said this fine, but three training sessions pretty much no matter what, I always go and rest. It's just my strategy, so I'm going to just stick to it. I love it, I actually said I'm looking for treasure, please wait. That was so funny. Like, you could have been in the middle of nowhere and he just randomly comes back, like, I'm waiting for treasure and then goes again. That is quite funny. That just seems a bit pointless. Gabby Mon should have said, oh, you know, he's gone out looking for treasure. So if you ain't got Gabby Mon, that'd be a bit awkward. 
That's probably why they've had to do it that way. They should have said, oh, no, no one's here, you must be out of treasure, like when you walk in. But then that could create a bit of a bug, so I guess that's why they did that. Right, so I'm gonna save and sleep. I'll save and sleep this, then I'll cut the video, and then I'll do like the next. I'll get my rain up to 600, and then uh, I'll be back in a sec. So see you guys in a minute. Alright, hey everybody, right, welcome back to part uh, 152. So hopefully this part I'm gonna digivolve. So let's see what happens. I think he's quite heavy, so I'm gonna feed him um, a super. I'll feed him a super carrot, I think. I don't wanna get him too heavy, so I'll feed him a super carrot for now. I need, well, I need to get thingy up my MP up a bit. I need to get my uh, other stats up, like my events and HP, but I need to get my uh, HP up, apparently, to like 4,000. My MP 3,000, I'll probably go back and get some more MP up in a minute. Because my super carrot's still active, unless he wants to eat again. But at the moment, my super carrot is active. So, we're going to have to see what happens. Right, so I do one more training session, I think, uh, on HP, and then I'm thinking I'm going to have to pretty much go back and uh, rest them again. That'll do, get him up to... Oh, hold on. I think he's digivolving, guys. Yes, he is. Hopefully into Phoenix, man. That'd be really nice if I got, like, something else. Dramon, Digimon, 
Phoenix, man. The best Digimon in the game. Oh, it's one of them. So my, I think my offensive and defense went up by about 80. My HP and uh, MP have gone up by about 1,500. My brains have gone up. I don't think my brains have really gone up, and my speed's gone up by about 80. So pretty successful. Let's see. I don't know. My super character might still be active. I don't know. I can't remember. Thing is, it's digital, so you get new energy levels. So yeah, my super character's still on. 192, it won't get that much normally. Well, that's 5,000 MP, that should easily be enough. So I'll go and rest him now. It'll be hunger in a minute, so I'll rest him. I'd probably overtrain him a bit, but I'd... oh well. It's quite good all round, though. Like, he's got 500, then he's got 5,000 MP and 4,000 HP, so I can just get his HP up to, like, 4,500. I think if I can have 5,000 HP, 5,000 MP, then I'll be fine. I know I've only got 300 offense and 300 defense, so I'll be next to go up. Get that up to, four, get that to 500 and 500, and then I'm pretty much good to go. Right, so I'm going to save it right now. So I've got Phoenix Mon, this is going to be another little snippet then. I know this is probably going to be a little bit annoying. What I'll probably do is uh, I'll train it offline again, and then um, probably after about two or three days training, I'll come back and I'll show you how I've got good I've got him, and I'll probably enter the Thunder Cup in a minute. So I'll see for that. Hello everybody, right, welcome back to part 152, right, so uh, this part I'm going to enter the uh, Thunder Court and hopefully win it. I did a little bit offline and uh, I did win actually. I got a bit lucky at times but I did win, so I'm going to see what happens this time. So this is the first time recording it, let's see if I can win it first time.
So I've entered the cup and I've actually uh, got all my techniques sorted, so let's see what happens. The electric card is sometimes quite good because I think it can like confuse people so that's why I've equipped it so let's see if it'll be enough. Yeah, I want to try and get my speed up to 600, if I can. That's the prime, that's one of the main objectives. So I can just basically keep spamming them with moves. So I need to get 600 at least on speed. Right, rest him up because he seemed a bit tired apparently. He will do because I did four sessions in a row. He's still a bit mad, but never mind. So I'll train this defense up a little bit and then I'll probably when he's uh, woke up I'll probably train his offense up by three train sessions then I'll go to the uh, fight, I'll go and fight then, see what happens. Thank <laughs> you. 
I had to think then for a minute what to do. I think I'll just sleep, so if I lose, I've got a bit of time I can just change my strategy. If I sleep and save them, I've had it. I've got to load it. I've got to go from here. I should win. I did last time. Right, so I'll go and quickly rest him up. I know I've probably overtrained him a bit, but I'll rest him up, uh, make sure so he's not tired. And then after that, um, yeah, rest him up, make sure he's not tired. Then I go into the uh, tentacle. That's what I was going to say. Can't remember anything today, man. My memory is gone. Ready rumble. So it's Electmon versus I think like some kind of Unimon thing. Looks like Unimon. It's not Unimon. It's, like, oh, it's the other one. It's Bakumon versus Purple Angemon. Uh, Bakumon's won. Thought Purple Angemon would have won that. Beermon versus Yammon. Yammon I think will win this. I would have thought. Oh, Beermon's pulled out a shocker there. Rookies beat a champion, okay. Once was expected that one, but never mind. Now I should win this one. Let's see what happens. I have got more speed, so I might have to use it. him off or just like damage him and then just hope he doesn't do any damage. I might go for the defensive win now, I don't think. Oh, um, oh. Oh, you, you know, some declared, yeah, I'm going to have to basically have to finish him, aren't I? That was a bad, that was a bad move by me. Right, Pins, I'm just finishing him off. We 
nearly got this one. We're doing about the same amount of damage as we should have actually. It's pretty powerful, so he's only... It's only, it's only a champion, it's pretty powerful actually. And we've won. With 18 seconds, we've got 18 seconds of gold. Well, that was a crafty win. And, oh, wow, he's won again. Okay, right. So it's me versus Veomon. Veomon shouldn't have 5,000 HP. He should only have about two, two and a half thousand or results. So I should just be able to knock him out. He did do some damage to me though, the cheeky get. And in about ooh, 11 seconds, I'm probably gonna knock him out. Yep, about 11 seconds, I'm not gonna. That was a quick win. 13 seconds, oh yes. Right, next one. At least I'm in the final. I think I've got this in the bag, to be honest. Oh, he's pretty good actually. This could be close. Come on, hit him with another one. Stop taking your time. Boom. I've got about 1,500 damage at the moment, so I think at the moment I'm winning. I can go Operation Spam Megalos part in this battle. Doesn't matter about MP that much, I've just got to keep attacking until he can't attack me. Or I can just keep attacking so I can knock him out, either one. Oh, I've got this one. I'm going to save and sleep this and then I'll, uh, and I'll chop this bit. And then, uh, 
I don't know, I might do a bit more, might do a bit more training on this video, or I might just wait until he fades away and then, do, like, tell you who I'm going to get uh, when it's faded away. But at least I've won the Thunder Cup, so I'll be back in a second, guys.